Oh. So, but it's not a... <laughs> Monkey? Yes? We made it to Rhodes. Woohoo! An ancient Greek island. Or Rhodes. Rhodes. Come in. Come, come. Where are we? You might want to go check this out. Wow. Oh my goodness. Look where we are. Ladies, welcome to Rhodes. Wow. Yep. <laughs> it looks like we are. We were sleeping. Good morning. Good morning. Good morning. Good morning. The buses, they're all showing up. All right. Let's go look at this. Coffee. Let's go have some coffee, guys. Look at this. Ancient ruins. Do I look like I'm ready to go for an excursion? Yeah, you do look like you're going for an excursion. Wow. Miss Monkey, how do you look? Excursion? She looks pretty Greek excursion y. Oh, yeah. She had some, so some trouble waking up. This is our ship. If you guys. I kind of forgot how big Ooh, this is. It, has water it's it is like massive. We just got briefed and we learned about Greek mythology, uh, ancient ruins why there are, it's so diverse on the island uh, because of all the influences that came in from other countries like Italian, uh, Malta, British and uh, now we are going to climb apparently 300 steps in the hot sun. Yes. Are you ready? Are you ready? We're ready. And if you're afraid of heights, don't go Yeah. Well, I'm afraid of heights, but I am missing it. You're I'm missing it. This. You're missing the Acropolis. No. We've now learned that the island is not called Rhodes. It is Rhodos. That's how you say it. Rhodos. Can you say it Rhodos, Mr. Monkey? Rhodos. 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 Sesame Street. Take it easy there, buddy. Okay, we made it to Lindos on Rodos Island. That's the beauty of the Carnival Cruise is that you just don't sit on a beautiful cruise ship all the time. You actually come out here and have great excursions and learn many, many stories from Lefty. Hi, Lefty. Hi. How you doing? Enjoy your time. Thank you very much. <laughs> and we are going to the top, the Acropolis, the edge of the city. Acropolis or Acropolis? Acropolis. Acropolis. Very important because it's very hot. Mama B always taking care of the monkeys. All right, Miss Monkey, we are going to the top over there. Are you ready? Hermager. Mama B, how's the trek so far? We've only done like 10 steps and I'm already drenched. <laughs> There's a cat. Oh, cat. I didn't know. Look at this view, guys. We've made it halfway. <laughs> we are at the halfway point. From this point forward, we will be in extreme heat. What did you find? What did you find? A rock. A rock. Oh a jelly bean. Oh my, oh my god. Is it highly venomous? The rocks around highly us. Venomous. There's so many it's rocks. It's highly likely she will find a rock in this location. <laughs> I don't see any rocks anywhere, guys. No. <laughs> I don't see I don't any rocks. There's like no rocks. <laughs> I, don't see any rocks. <laughs> I think right. I see one. Let's well, do this. All right, let's do this. You guys ready? Let's go. Let's take some sweet Instagram okay. pictures and let's go. <laughs>
ancient Lego blocks right there. <laughs> I don't know. What do you see, Mama B? I see history. You see history. Ooh. The ancient ruins. We found this ancient we found city. The ancient ruins. Well, now we know Actually, we were brought here in air conditioned <laughs> bus. <laughs> Who's counting? This is why everybody wanted to conquer this island and take over this city because you can see everyone coming from miles and miles away. Look at this view. There is where Paul the Apostle would come. Really? Yeah. Look, it looks like a heart. Miss Monkey is in the shade. Yes, Miss Monkey's over there. <laughs> in safety shade. So here we're in Rodos. One more. Rhodes. Rhodes? I say Rhodes. Rhodos. Oh, and it's really cool here. Here. Because, sorry, I'm like really hot and messing up my words. Later on, we're going to go to the cold water park. It's even more prettier when it's kind of broken down like that. It's so cool to see. Like the ancient city of Rodo. Minus 40 degrees, just conquered. kidding. Lindos. Lindos. Rodos. Rodos, everybody. Look at the water sparkling. It's so pretty. It's so blue. And that right there looks like a heart. Isn't it so pretty? Fifty-nine steps to go. <laughs> <laughs> that soapstone, sandstone, limestone. I think that's limestone. Look at that. Archaeologists here, or environmentalists, or <laughs> oceanographer. Oceanographist. Geographist or geographists. Mama, we were learning a lot. We just took like a detour into this like beautiful little shop here where they do all these. Amazing Hand place, made. handmade and you pottery. And look for the ridges, for the which ridges. is the fingers. That's how you know it's real. So whenever you buy pottery or clay, you gotta check for the lines. Yeah. And if it has lines, that means someone actually made it with their hands. Yeah. And if it doesn't have lines, it was made by a robot. It comes from the Greek word. Oh yes, babushka. Every word comes from Greek. Okay, so the word plastic, babushka. It comes from lathos. Plathos. Plathos, which means working with your hands. That's why we have plastic surgery, means the doctors working with his hands. The word plastic comes from Greek. This was their plastic back in the days. You learn something every day. Check out how solid this is. How do you find? So it won't, so it won't lethal, lethal. <laughs> That's lethal. Hey, Ms. Monkey? That's pretty lethal. That's how amazing the quality is. When it's done right, it is really hard to break. But, um, that this goes... Is for perfume. Oh, it's so for perfume. Be... The napkin this holder? This is what I thought the, this thing was for. You thought it was for tacos? That it was for tacos. You put the shell inside, and then you put all your foods in. You already know that it's all gonna fit in there once you get out, and then you eat it. Oh. So, but it's not a... <laughs> it's not a taco holder, Mama B. It's a napkin holder. So what this is for, it's not, it's, it looks like a regular cup, but inside it's not. You see how there's a line right here? Yes. This is something for the dumb. For the what? If they try to be greedy. Oh. So you pour in water, and you can't go over the line, not even drop. Okay. And if you do, it's all going to pour out. It's all going to pour out from the bottom. It's all going to pour out. Really? If you go under the line, it won't pour out. Really? So well, thank you for the lesson. What's the lesson? Don't be greedy, guys. Like, come on. Just take what you need, man. You don't, you don't need two tacos. <laughs> you don't need two tacos. Just you just need one taco. The boat. The cruise. The cruise. Back on the cruise, Mikey. Back on the cruise. Yeah. Yeah, y'all. Uh -huh. Yeah, y'all.